We're living in a different day. I've heard some modern preachers say we don't have to sing or preach anymore the way they did before. But it's old-fashioned singing and old-fashioned preaching that got my attention and got me to thinking about the way I was living and where I would be if the cold hand of death lay hold on me. The Holy Spirit used it and drew me to Calvary and showed me how Jesus Died in my place, with my heart I believed it, by faith I received it. That's how I got saved. When I was 11 years old, I went to Fort Bluff Camp in Dayton, Tennessee, and Brother Teru Marshall, he was preaching on the bull riding fool and how he had many chances to get saved, but he let his pride get in his way. And one day he was uh, out riding a bull, and a bull kicked him off and gored him right through the heart, killed him instantly. And to everybody's knowledge that knew him, uh, they said he never got saved. And I decided that night I wasn't going to let my pride get in my way any longer. I went down to that altar, and I got saved. Amen. It's not education nor organization, but faith comes by hearing God's holy word. It's not about style nor the methods we choose. It's all about Christ and the truth. But it's old-fashioned singing and old-fashioned preaching that got my attention and got me to thinking about the way I was living and where I would be if the cold hand of death lay hold on me. The Holy Spirit used it and drew me to Calvary and showed me how Jesus died in my place. With my heart I believed it, by faith I received it. And got me to thinking about the way I was living And where I would be if the cold hand of death lay hold on me The Holy Spirit used it and drew me to Calvary And showed me how Jesus died in my place With my heart I believed